What happens when you merge two iconic figures such as Bugs Bunny and Michael Jordan? Well, you get an all-inclusive Nice Kicks Throwback Thursday episode as we take a look at the hair Air Jordan 7. So see for yourself, eventually with your man Pierce Simpson, as we explore the history of this iconic makeup. Now, before delving deep into the history of the hair Air Jordan 7, it's important to know the history of the Air Jordan 7 itself. Releasing back in 1992, Tinker Hatfield looked to draw inspiration from the Nike Hirachi lineage that was so popular during the early 90s. Incorporating tribal-like accents throughout the bottom of the outsole, as well as the neoprene tongue, we see direct inspiration from the aforementioned Nike Air Hirachi. In addition to those previous qualities, the Air Jordan 7 lacks a visible air unit, and many would argue brought along the first Christmas silhouette with the Air Jordan 7 Cardinal that Michael Jordan would sport against his matchup with the New York Knicks back in 1992, as seen within his early edition of Nice Kicks Throwback Thursday. With the variety of colorways and different iterations of the Air Jordan 7, 1992 was pivotal as it marked the beginning of the hair Air Jordan 7 as seen within this incredible Whedon and Kennedy commercial for Nike back in 1992, showcasing Bugs Bunny and Michael Jordan himself. Hey, the rabbit can be sleep around here. What's all the racket? Uh, it wants a chalk. I was only kidding. Yeah. Gruesome, ain't it? <laughs> of course you know this means war. Air Jordan and Air Jordan. What'd you expect? You want my foot? Nice shot. Nice shot. This flaws them every time. Choice. This could be the beginning of a beautiful friendship. That's all, folks. Well, that's my line. The hair Air Jordan 7 features a variety of Bugs Bunny themed colors and iterations throughout the upper, as seen with shades of gray and white throughout. In addition, red can be seen along with orange throughout the neoprene tongue tab, and red details the bottom of the outsole. Michael Jordan would sport the hair Air Jordan 7 on a variety of occasions, such as this appearance on Saturday Night Live and in games against the Cleveland Cavaliers. Aside from its original retail release back in the early 90s, the Hair Air Jordan 7 would be a part of the CDP pack back in 2008, as we've seen the likes of Kanye West rock it during a studio session, Jay-Z as he took in a New York Knicks game, and ASAP 12 which he posted on his Instagram account, which you can check on Celebrity Sneaker Stalker, featuring our very own Ian Stonebrook. Several NBA players have been seen in the model as well, such as Monte Ellis and Nate Robinson, and collegiate athletes such as this San Diego State guard. What are your thoughts on the Hair Air Jordan 7? Are they worth the $190 price tag? Let us know in the comment section below. And as always, stay locked to NiceKicks.com for the latest in sneaker news and exclusive content. I'm your man, Pierce Simpson, begging you to stay safe this weekend as you go and purchase your shoes. Until next week, peace.